Hey, what's good everybody? It's a homie Chicano Shingu here. I'm sorry it's been a while. I haven't been able to upload a video. It's just, just kind of been busy with stuff. Anyways, for these next two videos, I got a bit of a surprise for y'all. So heading out to Incheon Airport right now. I got a bit of a quick trip plan. I'm actually uh, heading over to Hong Kong to go visit a buddy of mine. I'll call him by the name of Taco Daddy. I'm uh, gonna go visit Taco Daddy over in Hong Kong. So this guy was actually at UNM last year. But last year I was part of the UNM Lobo Friends program, which is they basically pair you up with a foreign student uh, that's then coming to UNM. They pair you up with him so you can show him kind of around UNM and just show him a uh, different stuff. So I call this cat Taco Daddy because I took him to all the good taco joints over in Albuquerque, like uh, Taco Mex, good Mexican joints. Like we went to a couple of Michoacanas and stuff. So right now we're gonna go uh, over to the bus stop here by Chumuro Station. So we're gonna take the bus over to Incheon Airport. So hopefully uh, this trip goes out good. So. Uh, bring you guys with me over to Hong Kong then. What's up everybody? So I'm here now at the uh, gate. That's gonna take me over to Hong Kong. It's just kind of a madhouse over at uh, Incheon Airport. I didn't really want to film until I like knew I was here. So everything's good now. So I'm through, I'm at the gate now. So just waiting. So the flight board's at 12.20, so it's 11.36, a little under an hour until the flight boards. Incheon Airport is actually one of the fanciest airports I've ever been to. It's like definitely up there with like DIA in Denver or like SFO in San Francisco. So I, which are kind of like the only airports that I've gone to aside from like the one in Taiwan and uh, the one in Albuquerque. Yeah, so yeah, just gonna chill out for a little bit. Uh, I got some the Munchan uh, from Paris Baguette. This is like the famous like pastry shop here in Korea. So yeah, just gonna get some the Munch real quick and uh, board the plane here soon. So I guess I'll catch you guys when I land in Hong Kong. So see ya. Everybody. Now I'm here at a Hong Kong International Airport. I just got off the plane about five, ten minutes ago. Uh, we just cleared through immigration, cleared through all that stuff, so I can uh, meet up with Taco Daddy. He's on his way. So yeah, just meet up with him, and uh, we'll see what kind of adventures we get into here at Hong Kong. I'm really excited for this. My buddy was kind of telling me a whole lot about Hong Kong, kind of really hyping it up. So we'll see what kind of food they got and stuff. So yeah, real excited for it. Check it out with me. Alrighty guys, so uh, we just got the bus. We're gonna go over to the hotel that I booked at. The neighborhood that I got it in is called Aberdeen. It's in Hong Kong Island. I finally was able to meet with my long lost buddy from UNM, Taco Daddy. Hello everyone. So this is my homie from UNM. We were Lobo friends last year. So honestly, neither of us can believe it that we were able to meet in Hong Kong this time. So uh, it's exciting though. I'm excited to see what Hong Kong's got. So it's gonna be dope. It's gonna be a good time. So we'll see, we'll see what kind of trouble we get into tonight. Alrighty guys, so I'm all checked in at the hotel here. So we're here in Tinwan, here in uh, Hong Kong. So Hong Kong is split up into a couple of different islands. So right now we're in Hong Kong Island in the, uh, Aberdeen is the name of the place. So uh, we're gonna go grub out here in a second. So let's see what kind of food they got here. Just check out Aberdeen a little bit here in Hong Kong. So right now we're gonna go to Causeway Bay, which is like one of the bigger, more popular spots here in Hong Kong. So we're gonna go check that out for a little bit here on Hong Kong Island. So we'll see what they got there. But so far I'm digging, I'm digging Hong Kong. It's really nice here. So go check out Causeway Bay now. We'll see what's up there. I've just been eating a whole lot, I feel like. Um, I had a wonton noodles earlier. Those were really good. 
and now uh, we got some street food. This here's the uh, fish balls, uh, not like fish sticks from South Park, but actually fish balls. So not bad actually. I'm not a big fish guy, but these taste pretty good. They got the fishy taste to them, but they're a little salty too. So I dig them. Mm, yeah, it's definitely fishy, but. But uh, yeah, I dig it. Food here in Hong Kong is really good. Like I said, those uh, wonton noodles I got, they're basically just uh, a bowl of noodles, but then they had wontons inside of them. The wontons are, they remind me of like mandu back in Korea, but food here so far is really good. It's on point. So we'll see what else we try out here. different type of noodle restaurants they took me here because this is like this, a spicy joint and so i asked them to order me the medium noodles but i feel like they're gonna pull a fast one on me and just give me the hottest <laughs> here so i'm kind of nervous i'm not gonna lie like i was looking at the menu here it was like a tenth of a chili was the coolest one and then the last one was like five chilies so i'm kind of nervous i ordered the one in the middle so we'll see how it is here so if i die here you guys will know i'll have him put it on my instagram like he just died so we'll see how it is we just ordered so we'll get our food here in a minute so we'll see how what's up <laughs> Oh, I don't like that it's look. Okay, it's not bad. Really? Yeah. All right. All right. So I just got mine. My homie here got a spoonful of uh, the broth here, and he's already turning red. So I'm pretty nervous. I'm not gonna lie. I hate this because it's like theirs is like like white, like clear, and mine's like the same but red. So I'm kind of scared for that. So try a little bit of the broth here. Oh my god. Not good. Like it's good, but. I thought you said this was a medium one. This is a medium one. See, when I get the noodles, it's not bad, but when you get a little bit of the soup, that's when it gets crazy spicy. <coughs> it is weird. It's weird because it's like the spice, it's like uh, like cinnamon spice. Like it's like it's like a little bit sweet in the spice, or I don't know, it's weird. It's gonna be crazy, but I think I can do it. I'm back in the hotel here, so I just showered up and everything. So I'm just kind of straightening out my stuff here. So got all my camera equipment there. So I figured I'll do the compulsory room video here. I'm gonna do this real quick. I just crashed. It's one thirty in the morning, Hong Kong time, which is an hour behind Korea. So and I'm still on Korea time, so it's like two thirty in the morning for me. 1.30 in the morning, Hong Kong time. So we'll go ahead and check out the room. So we'll do it the same as last time. So we'll do it back to front so you all can see uh, all the nifty features and the whatnots of the room here. So one of the weirder things, or I think it's pretty nifty, but I think it, it is a little weird is that they actually put a napkin on the peephole to uh, sort of plug it. So whenever you want to look, you take the napkin out and then put it in. Uh, yeah, so there's me. Uh, so this here is just a sliding closet. Yeah, just closet for stuff and a little safe there. So that's pretty tight. Uh, and here we have the old uh, bathroom. So we just took a shower, so yeah, just standard stuff, normal stuff. And then over here, we got the actual bedroom, so nightstand with a phone, bed, camera crap, does not come with the room, mic crap, just a little TV. So I'm kind of curious as to see what kind of stuff they have on Hong Kong TV here, but I, if you can see here, the view I got, the nighttime right now, so you can't see, but like down, oh, that's a stain, but like, like down over here is like a giant graveyard, a Hong Kong graveyard. So my friend Taco Daddy here pointed it out. He was kind of saying, it's like, that's kind of one of the worst views uh, we could get of just like a graveyard out there, but it is what it is. There's a nice view of like the river here. So that's Hong Kong, you guys. I guess tomorrow I'll be taking my cameras and stuff, we just shoot 
some photos, just shoot some stills and stuff so I can for, uh, put them up to my social media account. If you enjoyed the video, please like, share, and subscribe it. And yeah, uh, thank you guys for following me here on Kong Kong. Hope you liked the video. So yeah, peace.